any body of water saturated with sewage or slaughterhouse wastes can be quite appealing to sharks. Hapless swimmer is. What? Uh, no. Take vigilante fever has seized Port Clovis making it dangerous. I mean, I'm not an ornithologist, but I think it's probably a bad idea to get in the middle of the media's natural migration cycles. Just saying. Show yourself. Another shark draws to a close. of 73 was a magical time in Port Clovis when local favorite Trash Talk placed 20th in the Derby and the city placed first in the country for petty theft. This shark should consider returning to the water. While hunting bull sharks was made illegal in 1997, many shark hunters get around the rule by not caring.
Justice responds with swift retributive action. The bartender life ender, Bobby Bojangles. Despite increased aerial surveillance, confidence amongst tourists and locals alike is far from buoyant. Lord Clovis has grown bored of the hunt, leaving our shark to fight another day. Back on board the Cajun Queen. That's Kyle, my son. He's just here for the summer. Studies marine biology. <laughs> Look at that. I got one hand can still tie a hook. You got two can bend it tie his shoes. <laughs> Must get that from his mama. Yeah. He used to help my daddy around. Spent a lot of time together. But we wasn't close. He was a shark on him. That's all he was. If anybody were gonna catch the mega, it'd be him. <laughs> Thought it was a government experiment, got himself loose. Boy, he wanted that job. Wanted it bad. Found it once. Didn't catch it, no. What... what happened to your father? Huh? What happened? Look, uh... I ain't got time to answer questions all day. Got work to do. Just like Kyle LeBlanc, our young bull is the inheritor of a long family tradition, struggling to find her place in the world.
the bull shark demonstrates the importance of getting enough minerals in her diet. Retreats to the grotto for refuge and quiet reflection. Peculiar biological adaptation allows the bull to survive in fresh water.
18th and on International Turtle Day, too. can at least take solace in the fact that it's chewy and tastes relatively bland. Vegetation salinity zones in this area include fresh marsh, intermediate marsh, brackish marsh, and saline marsh. The resilient bull shark is able to navigate all of them with ease. Shark is never one to pass up a fat fiesta. of consenting adults wants to perform cryptic rites to shadow forth the prophecy of the great old ones, huh, who am I to judge? If it makes you feel better, I ate the heck out of some crockpot alligator kielbasa bites earlier. The locals here know every nook and cranny of the swamp. Vegetation salinity zones in this area include fresh marsh, intermediate marsh, brackish marsh, and saline marsh. The resilient bull shark is able to navigate all of them with ease.
the shark should really get some water in her gills.